Hey friends, welcome to the YouTube channel all about electronics. So in this question, we have been given that this impulse pulse strain can be denoted by this expression. So here, we have been asked to find the Fourier series representation of this signal. So graphically, this impulse pulse strain can be represented like this. So in this expression, when we put the value of n is equal to 0, then we get the unit impulse function at time t is equal to 0. Similarly, when we put the value of n is equal to 1, then we get the time shifted unit impulse signal at t is equal to t0. And similarly, for n is equal to minus 1, we get the time shifted unit impulse signal at t is equal to minus t0. So if you put the different values of n, then we get the impulse pulse strain with a time period of t0. And since it is a periodic signal, so we can represent it by the exponential Fourier series. And in this exponential Fourier series, this coefficient cn can be given by this expression. Now here, this signal which is repeating itself is the unit impulse signal. So we can write this coefficient cn as 1 by t0 integration minus infinity to plus infinity, this delta t times e to the power minus j times n omega t dt and when we integrate this term then we get 1 by t0 times e to the power 0 that is equal to 1 divided by t0 so for the different values of n the coefficients are 1 by t0 that means from this expression we can say that the signal g of t is equal to 1 by t0 summation of n is equal to minus infinity to plus infinity e to the power j times n times 2 pi divided by t0 times t where this omega naught is equal to 2 pi divided by t0 and this is the Fourier series representation of this impulse pulse strain so from this we can say that for the given question d is the correct answer